Replacing the clutch slave cylinder is not that difficult, but it is in a really, really tight spot to work. You're going to begin by safely raising and supporting the vehicle, as well as remove the rear under tray. Please see our articles and videos by following the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with those tasks. The slave cylinder is located on the left side of the transmission up near the top and indicated by the red arrow. You're going to want to move the shift linkage around to give you the most room to work, indicated by the blue arrows. Here is the new slave cylinder out of the vehicle because it is impossible to get a good shot of it in. Grease the end of the arm red arrow that is going to go inside the bell housing to engage the throwout arm. The bleed line green arrow will be on the top and the supply line blue arrow will be on the bottom. Disconnect the supply line from the slave by using a pick and pulling out on the retaining clip indicated by the red arrow. Then wiggle and pull the line from the mount. Some fluid will escape so be ready for it and do not let it drip on your head. In this image you can see the supply line red arrow. This is where you will be using a pick to release the clip and then pull the line out. The bleed line is located above it, green arrow. There are two tabs in the line that need to be squeezed in and then the line pulled off of the mount. Remove both lines. Remove the two E12 torque bolts red arrows. You will need a series of extensions and a quarter inch drive. You can see how the rubber covered arm sits inside of the bell housing. Installation is the reverse of removal. When installing, you will be fighting the pressure of the cylinder arm on the throwout arm. If you can, try and insert a punch into one of the bolt holes to hold the cylinder in place while screwing in the first torque bolt. Now bleed the system. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with clutch bleeding. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.